Hey guys, how are you? Welcome to the channel. So today what I'm going to do is to show you the second week of my rehab from the fracture that I had in my ankle. So basically, I had a physiotherapist appointment yesterday and he gave me a set of exercises for my um, routine, for the workout routine for this week. So I'm going to show you what is the workout routine that he gave me, exercises, stretches, um, some static um, stretches and all that. It should be uh, fun. I had the problem uh, last week with getting more than 90 degrees angle in the uh, ankle and currently I am able to uh, go even farther than 90 degrees, which is very, very good. Uh, that was my goal for the first week. The goal that we set, of course, is to get right on the dirt bike, but it's going to be a little journey to get there. Now, until then, I need to get my range of motion back for the joint. So I have a lot of work and it's a bit painful and the soreness is a bit, uh, it's not that fun, but it's kind of what it is and it's part of the journey of the challenge so I'm accepting it and embrace it so what I'm going to do no further ado not wasting your time I'm just going to show you the workout routine now if you have any questions and all that just let me know in the comments below I'll be happy to share with you my knowledge from what I you know googled and also what the uh, doc said um, that's it guys again I hope it will help someone out there and if not just enjoying my journey because it's fun painful and challenging which is good okay we'll see you in the workout in three two one and jump cut okay so the first exercise will be calf raise so what you sh what should you do it's so basically the first exercise will be calf rises all you need to do is just to try and put as much weight as you can on the weak leg. In my case, it's the, it's the left one. So try to put as much weight as you can on this one without getting too much pain, of course. So, and then use your, one of your hands just to support. Uh, currently, I'm using some, some bed. So, my, uh, mattress to support myself. I put uh, several mattresses one on, on top of each other just to have some support and try to raise both legs simultaneously and try to concentrate on putting some weight on the weak leg because uh, I'll tell, I'm telling you your body will try to put more uh, more weight on the strong leg so try to concentrate and and put weight on the weak leg so the calf muscles will engage more and beca because currently the weak le the the, um, the strong leg is already strong so you you don't need to train those those muscles you want to concentrate on the uh, weak one, but because you cannot put all the weight on the weak leg for too long, that's the reason we are um, we are dividing the weight between them. If you can try to do it one leg, I, I cannot. I, I barely can stay like that for ten seconds. So there is no chance that I'll be able to do it one leg yet so try to concentrate it will be uh, a bit painful you will feel the um, the foot muscles and the fingers uh, sh they should be a bit sore try to uh, concentrate on the motion so the down motion should be slow and controllable so and controlled yeah controlled so don't rush. You should you should get quality reps. That's the idea because that way you will uh, 
get the most out of this workout. So this is the first exercise, so let's jump to the second one. So here we are going to do the second exercise. This one, I don't know the, uh, the name for this one, but it just the purpose of it is just to roll back and forth your uh, ankle joint. So <laughs> that's a bit difficult for me. So what I'll do, put your strong leg first and then put the second one. And all you, need, you want to do, it should be like uh, shoulder width, maybe a bit uh, narrower. And then all you need to do is just to go back and forth. Now, for the first set, you, need to, you can do it with support. So that way you don't need to think a, a lot of, about balancing. But then you want to do it without involving any... Uh, balance uh, with your hands so you want to do it free and it's a bit difficult and then you will engage more muscles and that's the point of it so if you can do it if if you're feeling too sore just continue using um, the hands to support the upper body that way you will uh, take off some of the stress from the muscles now, as you can see, the range of motion that I got, um, I'm having right now is a bit restricted because of the, <laughs> the soreness that I have in the muscles, in the joint. And the reason for that is because yesterday the physiotherapist gave me to do this workout and I'm telling you that was very intensive for, for my, for my uh, muscles. So they are a bit so right now and that's the reason that I I'm barely can do it right now but I should do it so according to him you should do 100 reps with balance and then 45 or even 50 I go for 40 to 50 up to 50 without using your hands at all so as you can see when you're not not using sorry <laughs> when you're not using your hands it's a bit difficult and you, will, you, you, can, uh, <laughs> you can fall off from this thing. So be careful not to hurt yourself. Um, so just continue. If you can, try to squeeze more of the movement, the range of movement. So if you can go, let's say this is the, the weak leg, okay? So if you can, try to do it slowly, but squeeze out more of the uh, for better range of motion it it should be a bit painful um, again just listen to your body and don't do stupid stuff uh, so this is the second exercise let's jump to the third one and i'll show you what should be done so the third exercise using the same foam this foam is a half round so that's the reason you can use it for balance um, it should be cheap. I'm sure you can find it on Amazon or Aliexpress or any other website or stores. So again, first, strong, strong leg first. Now I'll put here, I'll put the uh, strong leg um, in the front first and then raise the weak leg to the back. And all you need to do right now is just to balance. So no hands involved, okay? No ends at all. Just try to balance like that. And again, if you feel if you're feeling that you need to support, I don't know, put put something nearby so you can uh, use it to counterbalance or use it for assistance if you need to have some balance from time to time. Now, just do it for thirty seconds, three sets. So thirty seconds, then switch legs. Now the leg, the, when the weak leg is on the back, it, it is more stress, uh, stressful on the muscles and on the joints, so it's a bit difficult. If you want to get more stress and more, um, and more stretch, what you can do, you can lean forward with the knee just a bit and you feel, oh, 
and you will feel much more pain and stretch and just try to balance again. It's a bit difficult, you need to work on it just to train your muscles to get a better balance. So again, 30 seconds, three sets, and that's it for the third exercise. Okay, by the way guys, I'm sorry for the, uh, I don't know, uh, scratch noises that you will hear from the microphone. It's because of the beard is grinding the microphone. <laughs> I don't have any solution to this one yet. I can try to attach the microphone to the beard itself and then it will gone, but then I will look very stupidly. So basically what you are going to do, you are going to put the leg, the weak leg in front of a wall, okay, closer to the wall. So the uh, toe should just touch the wall and then just try to touch the wall with your knee, with your weak leg, of course, okay? It's going to be difficult. So ju just to demonstrate to you how, it, how to do it with the, um, with the strong leg, with the, okay, so as you can see, very, very easy, right? No problem at all. Now let's switch and you will see how funny it looks like. So again, same position. And now, <laughs> that's like the first, they can I get, they, they can I get, that's like the first, that's like the closest that I can get to the, uh, to this area. Uh, you can feel the stretch here and also in this area. If you're feeling those stretches in these areas, you're fine. That's the purpose of this thing, is just to bring the range of motion back. Okay, now just do it for 15 reps, okay? 15 reps, three sets. Again, if you cannot and you can do it only for, I don't know, five reps, three sets or even one set, five reps, that's fine. Just do what you can do as long as you are feeling fine with it and it is not that painful. Now the um, next one is just to go and get the weak leg in front of you and try to bend it again and just hold it like that. So. Try to go forward as far as you can and then hold it for as one minute. You know what, 30 seconds is said, not one minute, sorry. So half a minute, just hold it like that. Okay, so those are static stretches. Now, when you will get this, the weak leg to the back, that, that's going to be a bit uh, of a stretch, so just be, um, be cautious with that. Okay, again, just go forward, try to stretch it as far as you can and hold it in that spot for half a minute. Then release it. Now, when you're releasing it, just do it slowly because it's a bit, uh, it's a bit of a stress on the muscle and the joint. So that's it for the workout, guys. It will take some time. Just walk on it and I see you in the next video which will be in one week from now. Let's hope that I'll be able to walk without any, uh, any assistant. Oh, by the way, I just want to show you what I meant by saying that I'm walking with two sticks. And I'm just putting those right here. Now, when I'm putting the leg, the foot, I'm starting with the, uncle, with the um, uncle and then putting the all uh, foot on the floor, okay? So, and that, ah, by the way, and the sticks should support this motion. So these two are coming forward alongside with the, um, with the weak leg and then you can start like this if, it, if it's too difficult or you can start walking naturally 
and not like one foot then the second foot to the uh, parallel to the uh, weak foot and then step again forward you can just go like that so okay guys thanks for watching sorry for the video being that long if you have any questions let me know and let's try to get better and better and walk again as, as fast as I can. Thanks for watching guys. Bye bye.